Imagine, a peaceful night shattered by the deafening sound of gunfire. The scene? Outside the $100 million Toronto mansion of none other than the famed rapper Drake. The victim? His personal security guard, a 48-year-old man, struck by multiple bullets in a chilling drive-by shooting around 2.10 in the morning. One bullet found its mark in his upper chest, leaving him unconscious and fighting for his life, rushed to Sunnybrook Hospital for immediate surgery. Yet, the night's drama was far from over. As the guard's life hung in the balance, police couldn't confirm whether the one-dance hitmaker was present in his luxurious residence on Park Lane Circle at the time of the incident. The shooting had left a shroud of uncertainty hanging over the ritzy Bridal Path neighborhood, a stark reminder of the ongoing feud between Drake and fellow rapper Kendrick Lamar. The two performers have been locked in a fierce battle of words, their former friendship in ruins, replaced by a series of diss tracks that have been hitting the airwaves over the past few weeks. But this feud isn't just about music, it's personal. Drake, the 2Z slide rapper, had kept the existence of his son Adonis a secret for years, until rapper Pusha T exposed his identity in the story of Adidon. Drake has since embraced his role as a father, but the revelations didn't stop there. Lamar, the humble rapper, had the audacity to allege that Drake had a hidden daughter, forcing the Degrassi alum to shut down the rumors in a swift move. But Lamar didn't stop there. He went on to accuse Drake of being a pedophile in his track Not Like Us, an allegation that the disgusted rapper vehemently denied in his own tune, The Heart Part 6. Sidebar. Do you think Drake was doxxed from the Like Us cover of his mansion location, Park Lane Circle? Or could this have been a long-awaited and calculated retaliation from Triple X Tentacion Camp? This just seems really odd. When Kendrick Lamar has really won the rap battle, there would be no need for him to retaliate. What do you think? Hmm, inquiring queens want to know. So, what does this mean for the future of one of the biggest names in hip-hop? Will this incident push him into the shadows, or will it fuel his fire, prompting a response in the form of music that's even more powerful, more raw, more real? Either way, hip-hop doesn't need another violent death on its hand, and we are praying for Drake's security guard's recovery. Let us know your thoughts, and please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.